So did you also install Windows 11 just like me and you are getting this error TPM 2.0 in the Valorant when you are trying to play then you are at the right place. So what is up guys, it's me Tabar from back from the Wikipedia. As I said previously that we are going to be fixing the TPM 2.0 secure boot error for Valorant. With that being said, you need to restart your computer and boot into the BIOS. For booting into the BIOS, uh, you need to spam the specific key that shows up during your boot. With that being said, you go into the BIOS and do nothing but just Go to the Windows OS configuration and then just change to secure boot control to enable and the secure boot mode to standard. Now here is a thing when you first time do it, when you first time do it, uh, it would say that it's not booted into the user mode. So you need to reboot back again to the BIOS and then turn it on. As you can see the system mode state is user and the secure boot state is active with that being said. So first time when you boot, it will be in the UEFI plus legacy. So what, so it depends upon BIOS to BIOS. So what you can do is if you do not have an option like me, you can just go there and turn it into UEFI and then save changes and reboot into BIOS again and then turn on this. It would be all right. Once you do that, just install those default keys, factory keys and you are good to go. Also, if you have no idea on how to turn on the TPM 2.0 or the FTPM, then you should check out our video, which I made a few weeks back. With that being said, you can find that video in the I button or in the description box below. I'll leave a link to it. So as you can see, the boot mode is UEFI. Uh, so I'll just repeat the steps. You have nothing to do. Just go there, go to the security and then just uh, enable the secure boot and that's it then save changes and reboot in the bios and then again check it i hope this fixes the issues uh, it has fixed many of many of the users one and it fixed mine too with that being said you can now play valorant and kill people i hope you like this video share this video with your friends who are also having trouble to people who cannot play Valorant just like me after installing the Windows 11, you need not to worry. With that being said, subscribe to the Techipedia and I hope to see you in my next video. Till then, Sanara.